हेलो चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू स्टोरी टाइम विद मिस निधि टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू रीड अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी इट्स स्टोरी अबाउट पासवर्ड चिल्ड्रन डू यू नो व्हाट इज अ पासवर्ड नो देन लेट मी टेक यू थ्रू दिस wonderful story which will help you understand what is a password and why it is so important so let's get started with our story for the day the title of the story is password please author of this story is vashishth mistri illustrations are done by radhika tipness and it is a pratham book let's get going manju was fascinated by locks and keys the soft metallic sound of a key turning in a lock made her happy the key bunch mummy kept tied to her sari was manju's favorite toy she loved to explore the mysterious depths of keyholes manju passed the village locksmith ranjit shop on her way to school every day She loved to listen to the rasping of the tools as he made new keys. One day, mummy needed to get a new key for her almirah. Manju went with her to Ranjit's shop. Ranjit picked up a flat piece of metal. What is this? Manju asked. This is a blank key, replied Ranjit. Then he held up mummy's key and said, "See these pointy bits that look like mountains and these curvy bits that look like valleys your almira lock also has mountains and valleys inside it the key's mountains and valleys fit that pattern so when you turn the key the lock opens i am copying the mountains and valleys from the old key to the new one so the new key will also open the almira back home manju couldn't stop talking about the locksmith she told munira aunty who lived next door she even told her cat who stopped licking his face for half a minute and looked very bored when her cousin riju came to visit that evening she told her to riju was studying to be an engineer do you know riju didi manju said if you want to make a new key for a lock you have to copy the patterns of mountains and valley from the old key to a blank key really said riju then it is a very good thing that mummy keeps the key safe otherwise anyone could copy the key and steal our things that's true this is the sort of thing that i am studying said riju what making keys asked manju something similar replied riju we lock up things we want to keep safe like the sarees in our almiras right manju nodded but what if the things you want to keep safe is information like what riju didi has manju like how much money you have in your bank account or your best friend's secret or the notebook of recipes passed down from our grandmother to your mother oh yes we need to keep those safe agreed manju if we have to protect this information we have to put it in a safe place and lock it there are many safe places like my computer where i keep my college notes said riju She opened her laptop to see my work. You have to type the password here. What's a password? Manju wanted to know. A password is like a key. The Almira's lock opens only when the pattern on the key fits the pattern in the lock, like a jigsaw puzzle. My computer will only open if the password I type matches the password I have set. If you tell anyone the pass word they can open it too so you have to be very careful whom you give your password to hmm when i get a 
computer? What should I set as my password? Manju wondered aloud. Some people's passwords are really easy to guess. Their date of birth, their pet's name or the name of their street. A good password is difficult to guess. The longer it is, the harder it is to guess. It is better if it has letters and numbers. But a password should also be easy to remember. Just then, mummy called Riju who ran off to greet her aunt. Ding! Went Riju's mobile. What might that be? A new game? Riju had the best games. Manju often spent her evenings pestering her cousin to let her play. Today, she would play them by herself. Manju pressed a button on her cousin's phone. The screen lit up. A keypad with numbers appeared. It needed a password. She pressed 1, 2, 3, 4. Incorrect password appeared on the screen. Then she tried 0, 0, 0, 0, but the phone did not unlock. She also tried Riju's birthday, 10, 10, 97. Children, do remember Riju's date of birth. I have a quiz. Oi! That was Riju. I have locked my phone with a password, she said. And I don't give it to nosy little girls. Manju stuck her tongue out. Now do you see why passwords are so important, Manju? Riju said, they are like keys to the things we want to keep right. Yes, Didi, said Manju. I only wanted to play some games. And you only had to ask, Riju said, typing in her password. Let me show you a new game. Guess the password. So children, get ready. I have a fun game. We are going to play with Manju. This game gives you clues to passwords. See if you can crack them. Phone passwords. Number one. Manju is nine years younger than her cousin. If Manju chooses her birth year as her password, what would it be? Remember, I had told you to make a note of Manju's date of birth. Look for the answer. Number two. If Riju's password is her date of birth backward, it would be what? Think, think and put your answer together. Number three. Remember the first password Manju tried on Riju's phone? What's that in reverse order? Can you recall and put it together? If you don't get the answers, you can play the story all over again and make a note of the clues from the story. Did you solve the clues? Remember, if you did, others can too. So here are some simple do's and don'ts. Don't keep passwords that are too short. 1, 2, 3, X, Y, Z, A, B, C, D are very weak passwords. So we should not use such short passwords. Number 2. Remember your password so that you do not have to write it down. If you write it down, someone might be able to find it. Number three, try to use both upper and lower case in your password. Number four, don't use words that are easy to guess like the name of your school or dog or town or city, name of your parents or anything which others are very familiar with. Passwords are used to unlock or open mobile phones, computers, safety walls in bank, our accounts on websites and many other things. Fingerprints and retina scans are also used as passwords. They are called biometric passwords. A password could also be a set pattern you trace on the screen. Like this, these can be patterns in the form of letters or numbers or any other shape which could be symmetrical or asymmetrical. So I hope children that you understood what is a password and how important a password is and what do's and don'ts we should practice while using a password. So children keep your things and information safe by making and choosing the right passwords and not sharing it with 
others all right so this brings me to the end of today's story i will be back again with another fun and interesting story for all of you so till then tata bye bye see you